Good morning. Good morning, God. One of the names of God, one of the titles that has captured people's hearts about as much as any other is the title Yahweh Roe. We know it better as God, you are my shepherd. It's something that Joseph used in a couple of chapters in the book of Genesis. It's something David famously used. The Lord is my shepherd. It's something Jesus used to describe his relationship with you and with me. He said, I am the good shepherd. You know, what a shepherd does for a sheep is about everything. A shepherd feeds the sheep, leads them to places where there's good pasture. A shepherd leads the sheep, leads them away from danger, leads them to the desired destination. A shepherd protects his sheep, even to the point of being willing to offer his own life to protect that flock. And the shepherd loves his sheep. He knows them by name, calls them by name. And they know him and they follow him because they know his voice. Jesus, in John 10, the good shepherd, he, t he takes care of us. He surrounds us with his love and protection. And in a world where today, like any other day, we will be tempted to make our identity, to make who we are about how much money we have or how good looking we are or how many accomplishments we have or any number of things. A lamb defines himself or herself by their proximity to the shepherd. And so the call today, this morning, is simply to walk closely to your Yahweh Roe, to walk closely to your shepherd. So let's pray from Psalm 23 as we finish our time together. Yahweh Roe, God, you are my shepherd and I shall want for nothing. You make me lie down in green pastures. You lead me beside still waters. You restore my soul. God, you lead me in the right paths for your name's sake. And even though at times I may walk through the darkest valley, I fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely today goodness and mercy will follow me and all the rest of the days of my life. And I will dwell with you, my shepherd, in your house forever. Amen.